Hi everyone, it's Varian here uh, with another episode of the Daily Snap Picks, the show where we pick the news. Kind of late today, uh, also forgot my adapter for my mic, so um, audio quality might be a bit different. But nevertheless, let's get at it. Let's look at the top 20 shared articles on Facebook. So here you have the first one, North Korea has increased nuclear production at secret sites. Already saw that one. Uh, leftist wins Mexico presidency in landslide with mandate to reshape nation. Interesting. North Korea has increased nuclear production at secret sites. Saw it. LeBron James reportedly signs four year, $154 million deal with the Lakers. Uh, that's TMZ. Hopefully it's true. Supreme Court to hire crucial issue with Assam's NRC tomorrow. So this is uh, Indian politics, crucial to relating public. Days after the remarks uh, said it would be possible to release it scheduled, da da da. Okay. Uh, let's see if there's anything else. ID department launches instant Adhar based pen allotment for a limited period. Um, this seems to be into again. Seems to be the same issue. Big Global Congress divided over alliance. No point me. Okay, we're in the news. Times person of the year, science breakers for speaking out against sexual harassment. Uh, yeah, I think, uh, wasn't it the same thing last year or was the hashtag me too movement? Uh, Collins won't support SCOTUS pick hostile to abortion rights. What's SCOTUS? Supreme Court of the United States? Uh, okay, I get it. Won't support SCOTUS pick hostile to abortion rights. Wow. Who's Collins? Holder would not ask Konami how he or she would vote on row. Okay, that's fine. Um, Paul George reportedly agrees to contract with Thunder despite Lakers rumor. Okay, exclusive for the Trump bill to blow WTO. It's a bill. Won't support a Supreme Court nominee who poses Rose losing column says she won't support a Supreme Court. Okay, Trump. Seattle becomes first major US city to ban straws. That's incredible. <laughs> that's funny. In one, fell, in one fell sip. Oh, that's fine. I became the first major city US to ban drinking straws. That's really funny. Okay. Cool, that's definitely making it. Uh, Joe Biden calls for Democrats to rise up. Force consensus pick for Supreme Court. Uh, okay. Yeah, good luck with that, Joe Biden. Uh, Mama, you're right to be concerned. Well, Trump administration stuff. Uh, Maple Leaf sign terrorists. Yeah, that was one of my Maple Leaf fan friends. i happy about that. Let's look at Reddit, see if there's anything there. Andy Sandberg supports Brooklyn Nine Nine co star Ted Cruz after testimony. Oh, that's nice. Um, I've been hearing about that, but I don't know if most people know what it's about. Although Brooklyn Nine-Nine is a popular show. I don't know if it's that popular. Um, after Supreme Court decisions, NYT leads story question values of weaponized free speech. New York Times leads story question value of weaponized free speech. News busters. What's news busters? Exclusive for the Trump bill. Okay, yours probably has unequivocal. Cool. Okay, we saw that. We saw that. More Trump. Man custody after pulling out a gun at immigration policy protest in Huntsville. Okay, Susan Collins says he won't support Supreme Court. No. Okay, right wing business funded groups. Okay. Intel community says North Korea's. Okay. It's. Fine, Chris Capital Gazette reporter weren't reporting fake news. World Cup 2018 power rankings. Okay, who cares? Waistcoat sales up as Gareth Southgate trend at. 
Again, it's very British. Uh, someday reportedly eyeing a takeover of FCA. Is reportedly eyeing. Doesn't mean they're going to do it. Um, plans to launch a takeover bid for Fiat Chrysler ahead of the planned retirement of FCA executive Sergio Maggiore next spring, Asia Times reports, citing not unnamed sources close to the situation. That has been the subject of to take over interest before, including by Hamday, but has denied in Madrid was likely. Wow. Um, already Fiat Chrysler is like Italian American, and then Hamday make it Korean Italian American, which would be funny. Um, but it's reportedly, so I really don't know if reportedly stuff can make it. Not reportedly, but um, eyeing. Reportedly eyeing. It's kind of very far from something that actually happened. Rudy Guglielmi asked for a round regime change at Rally Link to Extreme Group. Okay. Texas election. Here's to Blake. Yes, we'll ask you to interview your family. Okay, interesting. Uh, let's see if there's anything on another sentiment. Okay, Pardon and Peace can't use that. Uh, Fred Bax to get the best out of Pol Pog, but okay, football, okay, uh, um, entertainment, Trump, watch the real deliver emotional. I live with constant fear. Uh, a Tesla electric motorhome designed based on Tesla semi. Love it or hate it. Tesla's Class 8 electric truck. Okay, let's look at it. Check out these amazing stars for today's massive rallies. Okay, terminals bring Star Wars to life with laser AK-47. Ten years ago, this cable will be preserved. Okay, what's that about? Your two new photos are finally encrypted thanks to 16 year nine year old senator. Okay, that, that's actually interesting. This is this can make it. Alright, we still need the last one. Let's see what Newsbusters is about. Let's see what Tesla's one about. China brings Star Wars to life with laser AK force and they can set fire to targets a kilometer away. Uh, that's kind of scary. Maybe yeah, it's worth it after Supreme Court decision. Okay. Exposing the bank. Okay, that's good. Uh, can they reportedly iron the takeover of FCA? Iron the takeover. Not really. Take over, and this seems like a prototype design. Yeah. Okay. So here we have it. First article: uh, Lopez Obrador, an atypical leftist, wins Mexico presidency in a landslide. LeBron James signs with the Lakers. Seattle becomes first major U.S. city to ban straws. Your Tinder photos are finally encrypted thanks to a 69-year-old senator in China brings Star Wars to life with laser AK-47s that set fire to targets up to a kilometer away. Thank you very much, and hope to see you next time. Have a good day.